So Google have added Meet reactions in Google Meet, which is pretty awesome. I saw this one yesterday when I was on a meeting and threw in my first emoji. We used to use a third party tool to do this, but now Google have built it in. It seems as though as COVID happened, Google were pantsed by Zoom. Well, unfortunately for Google, Zoom became the darling of COVID because everybody switched to working online. And what did they do? They went home, they fired up Zoom and started getting their work done because Zoom had a few more features. It was a bit better at working across different companies. And Google, I don't know if you remember this, but they scrambled to add all of Zoom's features into Google Meet and it took them nearly nine months to do that. And so those were things like Q&A sessions, voting on polls. I think the ability to join as, as like a companion from a second device because plenty of people were like joining on a phone and a computer at the same time. So they built companion mode. But all these features were a little bit too late, basically. Zoom had already built them and Zoom became popular. And so it's a little bit bittersweet to see Google starting to bring all these features into Meet now because it's kind of like lagged behind Zoom for the last couple of years and everyone's just basically gone to Zoom. But we use Google Meet for absolutely everything internally and we do recommend that customers do that as well because there's a lot of great integrations with the rest of the Google ecosystem. My number one reason for using Google Meet is that anytime you record a meeting, and we particularly use this when we do training, it automatically saves that recording into your Google Drive, meaning that it's backed up and secured. You don't have to worry about converting it after the meeting or manually remembering to upload it or put it in the right folder or anything like that. And it automatically attaches that to your calendar invite. So if I've got a meeting that I have recorded, I've got a, a meeting here, and I'm gonna zoom right in so you can see it. And after my meeting, because I recorded online, it's automatically dropped this MP4 file straight into the attachments on the meeting. So I can go back at any time and actually hit play there and access that. Or if I've made, let's say a training video and I wanna move that into a training folder, I just click on the organize button and I can move that into a folder. So I would move that out of the meet recordings folder into my shared drives, and I would go to, where's my training? There we go, there's my training drive, and I would move it into my training drive. Boom, done, filed away. Now, you may have noticed if you've got keen eyes, there is also a transcript that gets recorded there as well, which is pretty groovy. And so Google are now letting you do a transcript, and what that's gonna let you do is see a transcript of what was said on the meeting using Google's pretty awesome voice to text system. So here we go. It even says who was on the meeting. <laughs> gives you an attendee list, which is pretty dope. But Google started adding some more of these features. I love the emoji reactions. Oh, it looks like they also work on mobile. Cool. All right, new feature there for Meet, which I'm liking. If you like this content, please hit subscribe and hit the bell notification so you can be notified when we go live or drop new content on the channel. Now, if you'd like to connect with us, hit us up on social media or join our free community group. All the links to that are right below this video. If you'd like to learn more about Google Workspace and the technology ecosystem, you can join our free Genius Academy by transferring your billing across to IT Genius, or you can join a Workspace Basics Bootcamp. Now, if you're a business owner and you're interested in an audit on your technology stack or your Workspace account, or you're looking to do a project in the tech world, well, you can take advantage of our free consultation. And if you need help right now, then consider joining Concierge or taking up a quick fix with our team for professional support for your tech stack.